just wanted to share one thought as we get ready for our 4th of July on Monday. Of course, what this whole celebration is about is about our country. And we're celebrating 240 years of independence as a nation. And that makes all the difference in the world for us to be able to live as a free people, as a people where you can have, again, different political views and still be Americans together. It was almost nine years ago to the date that I arrived as a young lieutenant to the war in Iraq. And there was a, a soldier there who trained my unit, was helping to get us trained before he was going to depart. His name was Staff Sergeant Travis Bachman, and I mentioned him in my message this year for the, the Cherry Days brochure. But Sergeant Bachman was just amazing. You know, he, he knew everything about doing the mission. He was helped to train us to do our mission. And only about a week before he was scheduled to leave, he got killed on August 1st, 2007, while taking us on a mission, training us again so we'd be ready to take, take the mission over. It's been nine years since Staff Sergeant Bachman was killed. And I think of him often, even though I didn't know him that long, because he touched my life. He had three children. His, his children were all young. And I think how many years they've lived without their father. And how many memories he and his wife gave up so that our country could be free. Excuse me. And I just ask us all to remember on Monday when we're celebrating all the beautiful events, the parade, the uh, fun carnival and everything that we just remember what it's all about and get our children up when the flag goes by, get them to put their hands on their heart for Staff Sergeant Bachman like him throughout all our history who've given their all their hopes and dreams so that even after 240 years, this country could still be the land of the free and the home of you, and God bless America.